Yes, of course we had to have another book box. Box! Hey friends and welcome back to our channel. Today we are talking about a new book box that we uh, have not had before. Everyone was saying how like they love this box and it was so popular and I was like sure I'll do one. So I got the September Spearcraft book box um, and the theme is fantasy versus sci-fi. My thing. And that is definitely Marshall's thing. To me I like the fantasy books as long as they're super entertaining. So I will have all the information down below if you would like to order your own, but if you think that there are some book boxes that you feel like you would want us to review for you, make sure you comment below because a lot of them have wait lists also, so we have to get in on that pretty quick. But let's dive in and see what we got on this one. Socks. So this is from... From that book series. <laughs> So this is from, Instruments. yeah, Mortal Instruments. Um, as far as socks go, they look like they're pretty long. Mm -hmm. um, Very soft. Fine. I wish the runes were more usable. <laughs> I mean, as far as socks go, like they're also, like socks are always usable. Not really something that I would gravitate towards when looking for socks, but socks you can use. A mug for your coffee <laughs> while you look. Or tea. Yeah. Books and tea. Mm -hmm. It says, she is Catalyst, she is Chaos. I can see why he loves her. And that's from the Illuminate Files. Yes, it is. is one of we both like that book, yeah. Yeah, that's a great book. Yeah, um, so the colors of the mug itself, I feel like, are really, like, eye-catching. But what's really strange about this mug is, though I really like what it's themed after, to me, it's not really something that I'd be like, ooh, I need that mug. It's just kind of yeah. like, that's a nice mug. Yeah, it's like, that's a mug. I like the reference. Cool. Let me drink something now. Th this one's also from the Amy Kaufman, J. Kristoff stuff. This is from the Aurora Cycle. Who am I to deny gravity, Aurora, when you shine brighter than any constellation in the sky? And, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's a purse. Clutch. Majigger. It is. Um, it's really pretty. It's exactly the kind of colors I'd probably gravitate towards. I just tend to like really small wallets. So for me, I'm not sure how much I would use that. But I will say also, so the first three items that we pull out of here are Spearcraft exclusive items. Um, I guess in like a lot of the book club boxes that I have subscribed to, it's been really cool to see like small business people put things in the box. Uh, for you to discover and in this case that's there's not a lot of that so you know that is something that I'm kind of like well that's different <laughs> but I think it's it's cool it's a cool design mm -hmm. so lip balm that's a thing it is boom mm -hmm. it's from the Mistborn trilogy by Brandon Sanderson there is a lip balm in the art print by artist at Denki Fish 1018 featuring Vin and Kelsier. I don't know anything about this trilogy whatsoever, but hey, at least I'm glad that there is like a small business or slash artist that is showing their stuff off. So that is cool. Lip balm. Get it in almost every box I get. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, this is cool. It's a cool art print, I think. And that's a lot about the book on the back as well. What is the scent? Do we know? It's a tropical smoothie. Yeah. And lastly, it's a book. So this is the book of The Other Side of the Sky by Amy Kaufman and Megan Spooner. There's also a signed book plate and a note from the authors that's probably in there somewhere. So what is this book about? Prince North's home is in the sky, in a gleaming city held aloft by intricate engines powered by technology. But North believes his sky island is sinking. Its engines are failing, and the key to saving his home is to venture to the place the engines were first created. Nim. Wait, the rats of Nim? I think that's a different book. At least this is going to be interesting because it, it looks like it's about flying cities in a fantasy world, so that's fun. It's interesting. Yeah. So that is everything that's in this Spearcraft book box. As far as like with the book overall, I think it's really interesting. There was a really, you know, a cohesive theme. You could tell it was sci-fi and fantasy and that was really great. I think the items in there are fun and they're artistic, but are they the most unusual items that I have seen in a book box? No, um, they are not. Um, I feel like that they're pretty like 
like the items themselves are just just a tad bit generic i was really wishing for something you know more interesting um in the box itself but i think the book is very good what are, what are your thoughts I'm thinking that this is just going to highlight how much Amy Kaufman is taking over the world of writing. Kind of, Amy Kaufman. You're like, I'm with this person, and now I'm with this person. What are you going to do now, huh? She's very good like, at, at working with other people. Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly, exactly. And she also does a lot of ensemble casts in these stories, which make them really That's fun. That's true. That is true. Yeah. So thank you so much for watching our book review uh, box. And until next time. Stay zany. Bye-bye.